Hi guys. Um, this is my very first ever video anything. So if I screw up, please be patient with me. A bunch of people wanted to see what I was making for um, ephemera keepers. And so this is just a little, this is what I did. Um, Nick the booksmith, Gail, uh, I'm, I'm going to butcher her last name. If, if you watch any junk journaling stuff, you know who I mean when I say Gail. And, uh, oh, I can't think of her name. Uh, Roxy Creations. I did remember her name. Um, this is all kind of inspired by things I've seen them do. Um, so basically, I started with, and I'm trying to make sure I stay in frame, I started with some craft paper and some scrapbook paper that I wasn't using. And I, this is full size. I didn't cut this down at all. Um, but the inside, literally all I did was use tracing pads, tracing paper, and cut it in different, cut the, oh, I don't know, about the width of my, excuse my arm, about the width of this ruler, which is about, what, an inch and a half, I think. Nope, two inches. They're about two, an inch and a half to two inches, depending on where I ripped them at. And I just glued these down so I could see what I was putting in here. And this is what I started with. And so I made several of these. And you can see I've got, you know, travel, text, mail and postage with labels. You know, these are all, this is all ephemera that I've cut out and that I've printed because I couldn't keep track of what I had printed. And then, you know, I've got people, which of course is Tim Holtz stuff. And I'm going to set these over here as I'm done, which they'll probably still be in frame, but at least they won't be on top of, of us. Old papers, botanicals, literally just used paper that I wasn't, I, I wanted to use it up. And if there's any glare, you guys, I apologize. Um, like I said, first ever video. And... So that's what I did there, and then I wanted something for full-size papers that I hadn't cut down yet, and I used two manila folders and gave it about, instead of a quarter-inch spine, it's about a half-inch. No, I think it's three-quarters of an inch, I'm sorry. And it's just, it's some place for me to stick these pages in here so they'll stop getting tore up. And for the little bitty tiny stuff, this came from Patricia, Patricia Viamonti. I don't, I'm, I'm not, I say names wrong, but it's one, of, it's one of the, see, I've got the little tiny Tim Holtz people in here. Oh, and I'm like, so not on in the middle of the frame, but like the little tiny Tim Holtz people, these are made out of uh, envelopes. I watched her make a deal and I had made one to see how to make it. And so I needed something for little ones. And then I made that. And then these are my favorite, and this is what I've been making since. Um, these are made out of a manila folder, and it reminds me of a, let's see here, am I still in frame? Okay. This reminds me of like a traveler's notebook, and I think I have a little more space with these. Maybe not across, but up and down, it gives me, a, I can put bigger pieces in this. Um, I did... Two signatures, three signatures, three signatures of about four sheets. And see, I haven't even put all these in here because I ran out of, I ran out of glue and I didn't have any tape and I'm going to try double-sided tape. I think it'll work better. But then one of the things I also did was I did this to cover where I stitched it in because I kind of cheated. I just ran it through the sewing machine. Um, but this is for my tags. Again, yeah, okay. Um, everything that I've printed off that's a tag. And then these are envelopes in the next one. So, like I said, I ran out of... I just used leftover... This are scraps, actually, from here because I ran out of things. 
um, you can make it with anything. You can make it any size. You can do anything with it. I just liked the idea of having the tracing paper so I could, oh, I hope I'm not making you guys sick. Um, so you can see what you've got in here, like on the little ones, you know, like little tiny things that have been printed out because I couldn't ever, f I mean, I had a big file folder full of stuff and had no, I'm also really short, you guys. So I'm having trouble trying to, to see what I'm doing. Um, but I, I couldn't find what I had. <laughs> so this is what I did. Oh, puppy dog here. Um, but anyway, short, quick video. These are what I made. These are what I did. These are what I put up that on. Everybody was asking how I did it. And I, I may get gutsy and try a tutorial, but I'm not sure. I've, this is my first video ever. So, but you guys all wanted to see the inside and I hope it gives you tons of ideas and you just go for it. Um, that's what everybody tells me when I'm looking at stuff and when I'm watching videos. And so good luck. If you have any questions, um, send me a comment, I guess on here or send me a comment on Facebook and, um, I'll try to answer any questions you guys have. Uh, I hope you're having a great day and I hope I did not make anyone seasick. Um, like I said, first, first video ever. So bye guys.